<laughs> it's a cold one today, but uh, headed to the gym. Mm, didn't put my jacket on, I should have. Headed to the gym, I didn't get to go yesterday. I usually, you know, start my weekly workout on Mondays, but we're just gonna start it today. Uh, hitting chest. I know the last time you saw me, I hit chest, and it's it's not like I hit it every day, it's just I happen to record on chest days pretty, pretty often. Y'all, that's a new PR, a crazy PR. 325 by seven. I've been doing 325 by four and did five and I was like, shoot, I'm pushing it. Did six and I was like, man, I feel like I can get one more. So went for it, new PR. So, oh shoot, what I just realized, you can barely see me, but what I just realized is I just hit a PR, and when I look back at it, you couldn't see the weight. So I bumped up 10 pounds. There's three plates with a 10, which makes 335. So I'm about to hit that, and hopefully through seeing how many reps I get on this, y'all will believe that I hit 325 or 47. Assuming this moves good. Moves well, sorry. So that was very sloppy. I don't know if you heard me say that, but he got it. 320, 335 for four. That's another new PR. Let's get it. I'm trying to get the shot of this bird, but it's not. I need a zoom lens. All right, guys. So, um, so as y'all see from the title of this video, and some of y'all probably didn't want to watch it because of the title. Some of y'all probably did click on it because of the title. Wait, 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 let me stop you right there, dude, because you know, well, you don't know, but what happened is I decided to try going vegan because of this video I saw and I heard all the amazing health benefits. It's like, man, we just gonna try it out just to say, you know, just to see how I feel. Also to be able to say, you know, I'm, I feel you uh, support vegans who wanna do it. And it was funny because I was good like for what was it five days i was you know i was turning we had you know somebody cook lasagna at work and i was like nah man nah nah bro i'm trying out this vegan thing it's the next day of somebody's birthday we had cake chinese food i ordered rice and broccoli and ate it with um some vegan chicken it was like chickenless chicken not so chicken chicken <laughs> and so i was you know i was I was breezing through it, man. And the last day I was here at home and I was eating and I had some of that not so chicken chicken. And that's not actually what it's called. That's just what I call it. I had some of that and I was sitting here eating. I was like, man, I'm not eating meat to try this vegan thing, but yet I'm eating something that tastes just like chicken. So I'm avoiding chicken, but eating something that tastes just like chicken. For me, I felt like this, I don't know, that's, 
I, to be honest, I felt stupid at the moment. I was just like, dang it. <laughs> why am I doing this? And so it kind of just didn't make sense to keep going. And then I started thinking, why did I do it in the first place? And it was just, I just stopped. So I was vegan for five days. And so this talk that I talked for about five minutes uh, or a couple minutes, I talked about five minutes. And so we're just going to skip that part and go straight to when I was talking about uh, dieting. So back to you, bro. I was inspired to make a video for people on dieting and stuff like that. And there was, and I asked on my Facebook, what is the hardest thing about dying, dieting? And a lot of people were like, you know, it's commitment, it's giving up the unhealthy foods, it's the time that it takes. And the two things that I narrowed it down to that make dieting hard or make it easier is two things and they just coincidentally start with the P. You have to have a purpose and you have to have a plan. It's easier when you, when you find a purpose, whether it's a wedding that you're getting um, healthier for, wanting to lose weight, whether it's to fit in some old jeans that you wore in high school, whether it's, you know, to be able to, you know, run around with your kids because right now you're, you're in pain. You have to have a purpose. If you diet without a purpose, you are not going to make it. You're going to quit. So you have to have a purpose. And once you find a purpose for doing it and get the strength and the motivation to start, you have to have a plan. Uh, the last week I've been saying, oh, I need to eat healthy. But I was showing up to work with no food. I was like, what am I gonna do? Oh, now I gotta cook something. But I'm at work, I can't cook something. What am I gonna do? Oh, I guess I'll just choose a healthy alternative. I'll do Subway and then get the Subway. Like, oh, I'll just have ranch. And then, oh, well, I'll have this. And though I'll just start tomorrow. So you have to have a plan along with that purpose. Purpose to get you motivated and to get you to start. Then a plan to help you see it through. So um, that's me. Um, I hope y'all don't feel like that was clickbait to get y'all to click on the video. I'm actually gonna try it out. Funny thing, my first attempt yesterday, I went and grabbed a veggie, a veggie bowl from Taco Bell, got it, tore it up, and I was like, wait a minute, there's cheese and there's sour cream in this. Also, there's avocado ranch. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to learn, I'm gonna have to do some research. And like I said, I'm just trying it out. And th that's all I'm doing right now. So um, yeah, I would encourage you guys not to go vegan or anything like that. But if you're looking to lose weight, find your purpose get a plan together and stick to it. Understand that whether you're doing a diet, going vegan, there's gonna be people that are trying to tear you down, people that make it hard for you and say, oh, you don't have to do all that, that's not necessary. Come on guys, if you're standing for something, stand firm and don't do it because other people are doing it. Do it because you have a plan, you have a purpose, you, can, you have a conviction. There's a reason, a personal reason why you're doing it. Do it for yourself, not others. And on that note, I've been talking way too long. Y'all have a good one. We'll see you in the next time. Remember, if you like this video, like it. If you loved it, share it. And if you want to see more con well, pff, content like this, <laughs> please hit that subscribe button, y'all. See y'all in the next one. Peace. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You get it. I won't ever feel like I've done enough. I've been on the low, but I'm coming up. If you want to roll, what you coming for? I'ma hold my partners down while I run it up. Run it up, I'm about to run it up. Run it up, I'm about to run it up. Run it up, I'm about to run it up. Trying to make my people proud while I run it up. Y'all can keep y'all bluffing, y'all ain't saying nothing. I just fight Hopefully got another subscriber. It was cool to see, like, homie, I told him, he's like, you taking pictures? I don't know if I recorded that part. But he was like, you taking pictures? I was like, nah, man, I'm vlogging, brother. I didn't say it like that. He's like, uh, I said, no, man, I'm vlogging. He's like, man, that's cool. I was gonna start when it first started going. And I, you know, I was explaining to him, I think I was recording that, but I'm saying this just in case. <laughs> I, I told him like, I'm a creative man. So as I'm walking around, I'm just thinking, man, it'd be cool to do this. Or it'd have been, it would have been cool to have a camera to make this. So now I just carry it around everywhere with me. So if I'm inspired, then I can do it. It's an art form, you know, being creative and entertaining people, encouraging people. So it's awesome to see that, man. So I gave him my Instagram handle. Hopefully he follows me. We get another one. I wish I had a cool name for my followers, like Low Gang or I don't know, something. We'll find it as we go, right? Yeah, we'll find it. We'll get it. We'll get it. I ain't seen a thing, but now I'm back and everything I see is my reflection. The impeccable, y'all. Yeah.